We are going to show you how you can use Filmora to make a clone of yourself. Gampash and Remexa wrote and asked this question on our YouTube channel. Can you please make a clone editing tutorial? How to clone yourself Filmora. Help! As a matter of fact, duplicating yourself is much easier than you think. First, let's see how the final video looks like. By using Filmora, you can easily make a twin or even triplets effects within minutes. All you need is a camera, whether that be a DSLR, point and shoot, or even your smartphone, tripod, computer, and Filmora. Now follow our step-by-step -step guide to make one on your own. To get started, find a stationary background and make sure there aren't any moving objects in the scene. Next, set up your tripod and attach your camera to it. Do make sure that your camera is located in the same place when capturing all those video clips. Now, let the actor perform on three different locations and record each scene with a separate clip. Also, record a video clip without the actor in. Now that you've got your raw footages, it's time to import all the raw footages to Filmora Video Editor for editing. If you haven't downloaded this program yet, click the link in the description box below to visit the website, filmora.wondershare.com, and click Free Download. Load all of these four video clips to Filmora. And then drag the clip in which the actor is located in the middle place to the video track on the timeline below. Cut any unwanted parts if necessary. Drag the second clip to the PIP track Click on the Advanced Edit icon here to enter the Edit panel. In the PIP Mask Library, scroll down to the very bottom, select a mask effect, double-click on it to apply. By doing this, we will block the right side of the second video so that the right side of your first video can show through. Adjust the width, height, etc. of the mask effect to accurately locate the part that you want to block. Next, drag the third clip to the PIP track. Likewise. Go to the Advanced Edit panel and apply a mask effect to it. Now, delete the extra parts to end the second and third video clip. It will look like the actor just disappears suddenly. Lastly, drag the fourth video clip to the end of the video track. That's it! This is the simple way you can follow to clone yourself in videos. We will upload another advanced clone editing tutorial, which shows you how the clones can move around freely in the video. Click the link in the description box below to visit filmora.wondershare.com and download a free trial version to get started now.